Everyone in this room is inspired by you. Who are you inspired by? Well, Kanye West, obviously. <laughs> You said. <laughs> Do you think there is other intelligent life outside the Earth? It seems probable, but I think this is, this is one of the great questions in physics and philosophy, uh, is uh, where are the aliens? Maybe they're among us, I don't know. Uh, some people think I'm an alien. <laughs> Not true. Not true. But maybe we are aliens. Of course, I'd say maybe that. Maybe we I? are aliens. We need some volunteers to be colonists. Do we have any colonist yeah. volunteers here for Mars? <laughs> um, actually, not many hands raised, by the way. <laughs> Most likely to be bad rather than, you know, like, like that's why we tax cigarettes and alcohol. Because um, those, those are probably bad for you. Um, certainly, cigarettes are. Um, and <laughs> um, <laughs> I think Mars should really have great bars. Um, the Mars bar. <laughs> how, do you, think, how, do you, how do you plan a business where you know, the rocket business, you know some of these things are going to blow up on the launch pad? How, do, how does the business plan work? I don't really have a business plan. <laughs> going back to Mars, uh, what kind of government do you envision for the first Martian colony? <laughs> um, so we're and, and, what's your, and what's your title? Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> emperor or God Emperor? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> might be too much. I don't know. Um, if, if you want, I have to watch my jokes here. Not everyone gets irony, you know. <laughs> remember, must remember. <laughs> Crazy car to have as a daily driver, particularly on the 405. So, um, but, but I understand when you got it. Yeah. You're driving down 280, and you wrecked it. No, uh, well. And you, th let me just tell the yeah, story, and okay. you can correct All it. Because right. the story's great, and I, I mean, hope it's yeah, true. Yeah, let's see if the story that so, you tell is actually, how, does that, how that compares to the, the well, reality, because the reality's legend. pretty messed up. So, <laughs> hopefully the reality's better. So you wreck the car, you get out of the car, you're doubling over with laughter, and the <laughs> really? person with you said, why are you laughing that you just wrecked this car? And you said, no, you don't know the funny part. It wasn't insured. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, the punchline's correct. <laughs> <laughs> what would be your mediocre superpower? Now, this is absurd to okay. ask you because Tony Stark is partially modeled after you. Right. So you actually are <laughs> sort of have real, so we have actually well, to downgrade. He doesn't technically have a superpower, he, I guess, <laughs> except like inventing technology or something. Right. So we're sort of um, asking you to downgrade from that a bit. So an example of a medio mediocre superpower would be um, the, one of the best ones we've ever gotten is this guy who wished to um, temporarily detach his arm while spooning with a girl. Um, <laughs> sometimes it's it's sometimes that, it's staying. That's what he wants to do with a girl. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Um, but, but how, I mean, on a, re a regular day for you, are you, are, you, are you sleeping? You're not sleeping a lot, right? Oh, geez, do I look that bad? <laughs> um, you yeah. Um, I actually met, uh, met a woman I, I dated briefly in, in college um, who now works at Scientific American as a writer, and, uh, and, and she, she related the anecdote that uh, we went on a date. I was, all I was talking about was electric cars. Um, it, that was not a, big, a winning conversation. <laughs> so it was a bit of a monologue, was it? Yeah, she said, uh, she, she said the first question I asked her was, do you ever think about electric cars? <laughs> she said, no, well, she so never does. So, so you learn from that, that wasn't the best yeah, shout out line. Yeah, it wasn't great. But, great. But it has, uh, recently it's been more effective. <laughs> there you go. I know this man. But when we, when we, when we talk, I remember when you first told me that you were thinking about tunnels. Yeah, when did I first tell you about that? Years ago. Okay, it's like a long time ago. Yeah. Like, I thought you were joking. Yeah, yeah, it was. I was joking. But the <laughs> <laughs> Young people globally who want to be like Elon Musk, what's your advice on that? I think that probably they shouldn't want to be. <laughs> <laughs> you? <laughs> it, it, I think it sounds better than it is. Um, yeah, it's, 
Not as much fun being me as you'd think. I don't know. You don't think so? No. There's definitely, it could be worse for sure. <laughs> but it's, um, I, I, I'm not sure I would, I'm not sure I want to be me. Okay. <laughs> uh, but <laughs> if... Uh, Silicon Valley, accurate or not accurate? The, the show? <laughs> yeah. Um, the, it, it starts to get very accurate around, ep, around episode four. <laughs> so it took a few episodes to kind of get, get grounded. The first few episodes struck me as Hollywood making fun of Hollywood's idea of Silicon Valley, which is like not, you know, not on point. But then by about the, about the fourth or fifth episode, season one, it really starts to get good. And then by season two, it's amazing. Um, in fact, r reality, the, the, the truth is stranger than fiction. All the crazy stuff you see in that show, Silicon Valley, the reality is way crazier than that. <laughs> Is there a parallel with how you build companies in that story? I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> so let's see yeah, what this be, thing can do. <laughs> uh, yeah, watch this. Um, that, that could be awkward with a rocket launch. Um, <laughs> and uh, we're finding the company for merchandise sales. Um, so uh, thank you for anyone who's bought our flamethrower. Uh, <laughs> You will not be sorry, or maybe you will. <laughs> it won't be boring. <laughs> Come with me when Moonbirds hits the sky. Uh, and he's, he's a designer, so he's, he's good at sort of the styling of the cars. Um, but he thinks it's all about styling. Mm -hmm. um, and, it, and, and it's not. Mm -hmm. um, you know, it's, it's really, this is, you know, the, the, the reason we don't have electric cars is not for lack of styling. Right. <laughs> that, that picture at the end is a picture of one of the circuit boards inside the roadster, right? Yeah. Um, we try to confuse the aliens as much as possible. <laughs> are, are you now like, fuck no, I am not starting another company? Or are you still thinking yes, that? Yes, that's how I feel. <laughs> that is. Um, we were first talking about the concept. You know, tunnels feel like a resolutely old school uh, solution I, to a problem. I'm that, that I invented tunnels. Dreams <laughs> <laughs> um. meet the sky And you and I will walk the by on by on by Well, this is really winning. <laughs> <laughs>